All right, we just left Matchless and now we are actually right around the corner at a little brewery called Triceratops. These guys came out from the East Coast about 10 years ago, I believe is what it said, and uh, moved in out here. Um, my stepdaughter loves this place, so this is her favorite place in Olympia, so we will see what it looks like. Um, it's dark out, so you can't get a whole lot. They have a very small seating area right here, so you can kind of see, and then we'll go inside here into the thing. Surprisingly, surprisingly, they are open until 9 o'clock on Sundays, which is kind of odd. So we're going to buzz in here and see what it's like. Okay, here's a little better view of their outside. They've got two picnic tables. What's that tell you? That's the beer garden compared to the other place we are just at. So let's come in here and check it out. It is tiny in here. Obviously, they are uh, firefighters. So, I figure it's one thing if I find it's a really a neat little place. So, that's a cool table. Rob, I want your power machine. All right. I'm Don. Hi, Don. I'm Mike. Are you the owner? <laughs> I wish. <laughs> Are you the brewer? I am a volunteer. Okay, me too. The owner is my friend, and he needed a night off, so I stepped in. You know what? That is very nice. I mean, you got to do what you got to do. I like to just... I'm, I'm taping all my beer travels. All right. Like my wife said, I spent the day in Bellingham yesterday. So, I have a drinking... I figure I might as well... That there's only 24 hours in a day. Yeah. So, do you guys have... Um, Flights. Flights? Yes, yeah, we do. That's why I waited to order until you came okay. in. Five or six. How many you want? Do I don't care. <laughs> do them all. Oh, look at these Six is all of them. They have the uh -huh. yeah. Nice. If you want to do them all, we could do six. We, no. Oh, okay. We have something very similar to the pencil tucky right now. The, the, um, uh, you scratched my anchor. Oh, cool. It's well, a, definitely. It's a um, California... It's like an anchor steam. Okay, yeah. yeah. I really like anchor steam. Like you could do so. all six of them. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Okay, yeah. well, let's do all six, six of them. Six? Yes. Yeah. So. Um, I really like their, their beer. They have the chainsaw that has TBC on it. Look so what, what they have. They have a pay it forward. Someone's not here buying yes. them a beer. Isn't that cool? Oh, yeah. That's cool. I would totally drink that. To go with the uh, yeah. pay it forward. I totally would have that. Yeah. I had a. Yeah, yeah. I had a. Yes, we should. We will. And this is where the magic happens back here. I won't go too far back here, but that looks pretty good. You can you can come all the way back here, like where the barrels are at. Boy, look at all those kegs. Looks like, oh, Skagit Valley Malting. So they, they do some local malting since we live in the Skagit Valley. So anyways, we're gonna get all six of their samples and we're gonna see how well they are and we're gonna actually pay it forward to my future, hopefully, uh, son-in-law. I don't know who you guys are, but that is a colorful, colorful flight. There is definitely uh, some good stuff on there. There's a peanut butter stout. There's Cherry Gruber. That's a nod to Hans Gruber. There's a Molly IPA. Uh, you Scratch My Anchor, which I was told is a nod to the movie Caddyshack. There's a brown, Ain, brown ale and a tangerine dream. Sure is pretty. And there's my wife coloring. Yes. Oh, yeah. She's bored. She's got her Chuck and that brilliant sweatshirt on. Anyways, let's drink.